Dean was high by cool stuff. So we're out at Green Lawn Grove. It rained, but yesterday a lot, but they're set up out in the parking lot. So let's get shopping, see if we can find some cool stuff. There's gonna be two videos today, so watch for a second one at the Yak Arena. Not sure why that turned off. The dogs are not happy today. What's up, Florin? Happy blessed Saturday, man. Don't forget Yak Arenas today. That bag of shot is full. <sighs> What's that, yeah? Uh, garage sale, flea market, whatever. Oh, okay. Hey, hey, what's up? Did you find something good? It's cooking. I got a couple of these. That's good. Those are 1970s ish. But what is this? Vintage. That's Star Wars? Yeah. I've never... Oh, that's for the Ewoks like? Yeah. I got it from Massachusetts. Exactly what that's it is. cool. The only reason I bought it is because my buddy's coming up for a model show. Good. He was able Good. to put it in this van and get it to me for free. Wow. So I just paid him. That's cool. I paid up on it, but I... Well, you it's have a good, to. It's a good piece to put at the back of your boot. You have to. And I got it. So Jeff has always got cool stuff, so. You going in the jewelry business today? Just today. Today and today, today only. Today's the day. <laughs> if not, what? How you doing? Good, good. How's about yourself? It was cold this morning. It was cold? Cameras. He must have bought a huge collection of cameras and stuff because he's been bringing cameras for the last month. There's a cool clock. It's a day date. And see from the chimes in there that it's gonna probably have Westminster Day chi Westminster chimes. Kind of cool. But you gotta come out and see if you can find anything. Razor blades. How much are razor blades? Jewelry. It's a metal. All right. So. Adding some new stuff here to go around the corner and show you, maybe. Mm 
How much did he get? Some boots. Well, he said that. He said that. Nice boots. Let me hat up and try it out. So they are putting a new permanent roof here by the concessions. A steel roof. That's kind of cool. So for a place that's been here got to be 70 years still going through changes still trying to grow so, uh, let's see if there's anything very interesting here kind of like this what is this how you doing Looks like it's supposed to be an ashtray, but yeah, it looks like there's so. I don't know for sure, but uh, a bunch of it missing. Yeah, I should think be the like here right or up yeah. there maybe. Yeah, I, I think in there. But I probably could find something that matches there. Pretty good, you know. I think she's got. Uh, I don't know where she went. She'll be back here in a minute. All right. Skip over to this side of the aisle. See if we got anything over here. He's usually got tools, but sometimes he's got interesting stuff. It looks like just tools today. Rings. Stuff here. Empty cigar boxes. originally had a cork and a screw on cap. Morning. So a lot of this stuff you can walk past when you're out here marketing. But hopefully we can find something cool. There's a lantern but it don't look like nothing special. Shovels like this, you know. Kind of smart to us. How much is a shovel? Forty. Don't know why it would be. A shovel like this. Huh. I don't see no military. You missed the shovel though. Oh, I know. I'm too old to dig foxholes. You're too old to dig foxholes? Like my dad didn't like them shovels. He liked to pick and scoop it out with uh, All right, we're gonna metal. see what we can figure out about this. He says it's dated 44. What country is that? It's Mark yeah. US. And it's not a folding shovel. Right. That might be the first one I ever saw. Take 10 on the shovel? Yeah. I'm All right. So we'll buy the shovel. Uh -huh. Okay, well, I'll just see. You got me by 20 years. So, that shovel, I believe, is the before the folding shovels and after the T handles. So I'm sure it's somewhat rare. So, 
I've never seen one before. <laughs> Phil, who came up, and I think I got Phil on there. He uh, He's the one that turned me on to the helmet. So, uh, he said he had never seen one before. So, you buy the things you haven't seen, and you go from there. Huh? Here's a bunch of... Good, good, good. Bunch of Vaseline glass. Pretty cupie doll. She's kind of cool. Anyhow, we got a shovel for ten bucks. Would not surprise me if it's a hundred. So that's why I bought it. Alright, so we're at the back of the market and it's kind of thinned out, so let me hit pause. Alright, so walk through the dead spot where there was no people set up. What are you doing, Freeman? Loafing? What you doing? Loafing? Yeah, I'm just hanging out, man. You in the guitar business instead of the gun business now? Yeah. I'll all my guns for guitars. $10 hatches. <laughs> I just bought a $10 shovel. Oh, cool. My old buddy Freeman. <laughs> Knowed him for... Hey, man, I want some money for that now. 40 years. Oh my gosh! You know, you know, if you were a little prettier, you might get some money. But you ain't getting no money for looking like that. Thinks he's gonna be a YouTube star now. So let's skip across here real quick. Hey, what's up, man? Got me a shovel. What do you got? All kinds of stuff. What did you say, Kim? Hello, dear. How are you? Did your stuff survive the winter? Yeah. Are you going to come to Grace's graduation party? The 22nd. What, what June. Getting her through. Well, I've used a shovel like this on her twice a week to get her through, but yeah. Uh, she's talking about it. Uh, she's not... Uh, tomato plants? Tomato plants? Yeah, them are tomato and plants. Parsley. And parsley back there? And then you water them with the... <sighs> Miracle grow. So, anyhow. Never ever thought I would see pot plants for sale at the flea market, but got some blow molds over here. Let's see what the blow molds are. I like the pumpkin. Mary and Joseph. How much is the pumpkin? How much? 55. No room at 55. I don't know that I've got that Daffy Duck. Come and see if this guy's got anything over here. And then we'll hit pause again. Yeah, 
Ooh, the hat. Just see things. What in the world are them hats for? How much? How much are these? Oh, that's the projector for it. Yeah. I got the hand viewer. I don't have the projector. It's a Fisher Price, and these go in there. Ten bucks. Oh, this and that. Ten bucks for these and this. Yeah. Oh, it shows on the screen. It sits like this. Gotta get the orientation right. And then it projects it up on there. Got it. Got it. I, I used to have that too. Did you? Yeah. Hey. I've never seen a pipe like Five. Okay. Alright, we I bought the to, I used to have Fisher Price thing. I sold it. Bucks. Let's put it down and get the man paid. Alright, so we'll see if it works. Take it home and play with it. I'd give five for the three tapes. I don't know what they are. But it was something from my kid childhood that I remember. So had to buy it for five bucks. I wasn't gonna give them ten. But it is something from my childhood that I remember. And so you put them cartridges in, and they've got uh, probably 16 millimeter, 8 millimeter film on them. And uh, you crank the handle. This one's going to project it on the TV screen. So. So we're back down here. What's up, Dennis? Got any Yeti cups? <laughs> Drop my cord. Lots of stuff, but it doesn't look like my kind of stuff. The military canteen. Hammer handles. Five bucks. We need axe handles. We got some neat toys. Oh, I love Tamiya models. They are the best quality models. That's Sinclair anchor truck. That's kind of cool. More toys. So, yeah. what them bottles were for. Just see stuff at the flea market, you just kind of go, huh. But you have to come out and see it to buy it. or nothing. Do all this stuff. Lots of tools today. See 
some razors. What are you getting on the razor blades? Which one? I don't know. I have a lot of different things. You know, I have like, oh, it's a 20, that's 15, that's 8, that's 12. I mean, like, you know, $5, but you have like four more like that. Right. Somebody can put in the description why razor blades are so expensive. I'd love to hear why. So not too much today. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Bought something from my past. Bought a neat shovel, World War II. And uh, we're going to get this turned off. And so watch for another video from the Yak Arena. So, like I always say, God bless you and God bless America.